G'day, we're here to answer another question from a viewer, and it's how to adjust the temperature or calibrate the temperature on your wrapped pill. First, you should leave your wrapped pill in water for a good couple of hours to equalize out the temperature inside the pill itself. If you try to rush this, you'll get it wrong. Once you've done that and you know what your pill is reading, you can get an accurate thermometer and take the reading of the water. So we've got 16.1 there. You can see here it's reading 16.3 degrees. Or if you've got it hooked up through the portal, you can look through the portal and get the temperature there. I'm using the temperature controller at the moment because for me to get a reading out of there, it's going to take about an hour for the next reading to come through. Then you would take your pill out, dry it of course, plug it into a charger. Well, I'm going to go in to the pill via my iPad, I'll record the screen. Alright, so we go in to the Wi-Fi and there is Kegland Wrap Hydrometer. Try and connect to it. It's not connected to the internet, that's alright. We don't need it connect to the internet. And we're in. So what we need to do is go into Make sure yours is up to date or you might not find these settings. And the way you do that is go into your diagnostics and you can check for new firmware. Mine should be up to date. I did it yesterday. Oh, there you go. Checking for firmware update. Current firmware is up to date. So we're up to date. We can go into settings and there's your temperature offset. Value in degrees will be added to temperature readings. I was only reading 0.2 up, so I could go minus 0 0.2 set temperature offset. This is going to be impossible for me to show you to test it now because it's warmed right up now it's out here. I'd have to put it back in the water you know, for another couple of hours for it to get right back down to the temperature of that water. But there you go, that's where the temperature offset is. And you can have a little bit of a play around with that and do a few tests until you're happy with it. All right, hope that helped. Take it easy. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.